Hi everyone, this is Miss Sahra and this is the last video um, that will help you review for term two exam assignments. Okay, we've already gone over the structure of our exam. We have 15 multiple choice questions and five written response questions. Okay, this video is about lesson three, impact of energy usage. There will be two questions from uh, this lesson, one on page 129 and one question from page 132. The question from page 132 is going to be a written response question. Free response question means that you will have to write an answer. The other page, page 129, will be multiple choice questions. So let's look at some impacts from using energy resources to produce electricity. When we produce electricity, sorry about that. When we produce electricity, a few things may happen. So impact, we are looking at what does it do to the environment around us? So over here in this picture, we can see that they are mining. They are mining to remove fossil fuels, uh, which is coal. So they are mining coal, but any mining of fossil fuels will cause damage to the environment. It will cause animals to lose their home. So fossil fuels are coal, oil, and natural gas. And when we mine for these things, we cause a loss of habitat. That means animals lose their homes. So this is an impact of mining for fossil fuels. When we build dams to create hydroelectricity, so over here, Sorry about that. Over here we have a dam and it is being built to produce hydroelectricity. When we build this dam, we cause also a disruption. As you can see here, they had to clear a lot of land. So this also causes loss of habitat. It will also cause a problem for Fish. If you think about what lives, what animal lives inside of water, it is a fish, right? So these little fish, they can't go back and forward because the dam is in the way. And some fish only lay their eggs in the same place every year. So now they have a problem. They can't go back to lay their eggs and um, it will cause a problem for the fish. They don't know where to go. So it causes problem for fish. We call it migration when they uh, move from one place to another to lay their eggs. Okay, so fish are the ones that are having a problem with um, hydroelectricity. We look at the last picture. I'm sure you can tell by now what has happened to these poor birds over here. So wind energy is produced by these um, big turbines and this wind energy or wind power will cause a problem for birds. As birds fly into them, they can cause them to die. Okay, so this is an impact from using energy resources to produce electricity. Okay, you may read more about it on this page. You can pause it and go through it. Um, there are two questions on the bottom of the page that may come through as well. For example, uh, how does burning fossil fuels cause pollution? So um, as we burn fossil fuels, we end up with pollution in the air, so air pollution. And as we have this strip mining, we end up losing trees, plants, and soil. They are cleared away from here. 
Okay, so now let's look at our written response question. Over here, you may be given this hill, and then they will ask you to answer the question. What are some ways people can conserve resources? So look at the pictures and then answer according to what you see in the picture. Over here, we can see that there is a light. So how can I save? Conservation means to save resources. So to use less. Okay, so one thing I can do is to turn off the light when I leave the room. So as discussed in our class, most of you said you can remember the word put off instead of turn off. So we will try and use the word put off. Okay, so put off the light when not using. So when you are not using it, if you put off the light, you will save energy. Same thing goes for this device. Put off computer when not using. Okay, so even if your English is not good, you can remember, memorize, put off. And then you just know, look at the picture to change the word, right? Over here we can see our shower. Okay, so this one is a little different because we are going to say take short showers. If you use a short shower, this is one of your words for English, so you should be knowing the spelling, take short showers, you will save energy because less water is being used, so less water has to get heated up. Over here we have a picture of a tap. And remember, we're not talking about saving water, we're talking about saving energy. So here we will say again, put off hot water when not using. Okay, because hot water is the one that uses energy to heat up. Over here we have a picture of a car. If we share our car, the word for sharing your car is called to car pool. If we carpool when we can, we will save energy. So if you cannot remember the word carpool, it means to share your car. Okay, so share your car ride when you can. Carpool means to drive together to the same place. The last one is showing you it's an olden day thermostat, the thing that we use to turn the AC up and down. Okay, so put off the AC when you are not using it. We all know the AC uses a lot of electricity. So when the weather is not too hot, like right now, we can turn off the AC, put off the AC for not using. So I hope you've realized that for most of these, if you end your, you start your sentence with put off, say what's in the picture, and then end it with when not using. Please remember to write complete sentences. If they do not make sense, we cannot give you the mark, okay? So please go through them, turn them into sentences. There will probably be some lines here at the bottom of the page. They will, you will have to complete your answers over there, okay? okay? So here are the answers from the book. You may go through it. But again, I've shown you an easier way of learning it, right? Okay, another question you may be asked, because maybe they may ask you something completely different. They may ask you, what does conservation mean? We started off with saying conservation means to save and use resources wisely. And the last thing we may ask you is what are the three R's? They are reduce, reuse, recycle. Okay, here's your last practice. Please go into it, give it a try, and good luck.